This morning with the U.S. reporting another record day of deaths. We are extraordinarily worried. Experts say California is just beginning to see the surge from the Thanksgiving holiday, with hospitalizations rising 80 percent, some medical centers forced to turn people away. We have an unthinkable number of COVID patients yet to come in the coming weeks. Similar strains are happening in hospitals across the country. More than a third of Americans live in areas where hospitals are running critically short of ICU beds. With the U.S. reporting another record day of deaths, the highest positivity rate is in Idaho, where like many other states, small hospitals are at a breaking point. It becomes very scary. It, it becomes very difficult to handle. Back in central California, at least three counties have run out of beds in their intensive care units. Outside Los Angeles, some hospitals are running out of space. We ended up making this our emergency department lobby. This week, the ER, ICU, and COVID floors at the Regional Medical Center in San Jose filled up, at times exceeding capacity. What we're seeing now is a sustained demand for a high number of uh, acute care beds. State health officials estimate 12 out of every 100 people who test positive will be hospitalized, leaving California struggling to care for its sick. The first state to shut down at the beginning of the pandemic, some experts believe the easing of restrictions in the face of rising numbers, pandemic fatigue, and the sheer size and diversity of the state may have contributed to the turn of events. It is unclear to all of us here on the front line how we are going to manage and handle this. This morning, California's crisis signaling trouble to the rest of the nation. We are now exactly two weeks from Christmas Eve and medical experts up and down the state and across the country are begging people to cancel plans if they plan to travel to see loved ones, warning that the visit could have deadly consequences. Hoda. All right, Miguel Almaguer for us in California. Miguel, thanks.